Good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning. Welcome to another vlog. I'm actually headed out. I'm going to hang out with a friend and I'll come back later on in the evening. So, if you're new here, my name is Emily. If you are a returning subscriber, you, friend, are my favorite person and you don't even know it yet. So, I want to submit the outfit of the day as well as the scent of the day. So here you go. Story of my life. I can't figure out which shoes to wear, but I think I'm going to go with these. And those are my jeans. They are from Chicker. And that's my blouse that I thrifted from Gikomba. One thing about me, one thing about me is when I buy new clothes, I'll try them all out, back to back, like, like that. I got these two shoes at Gikomba and that is my bag for the day. I'm looking to buy the real deal of this bag, which costs a lot of money, child. So pray for your girl to get enough Benjamins to spoil herself with the bag. So yeah, that is my outfit of the day. And as for the scents, my scent of the day is Victoria's Secret Bombshell and Gingham by Bath & Body Works. It's currently at 4.30 so I'm headed home before Nishikwa na curfew and they were gracious enough to buy me these white roses. You need people in your life that buy you flowers. So yeah, now I'm uh, headed home so I'll catch you guys later on. Mm -hmm. That is my flower setup, guys. I never, ever, ever put flowers on my coffee table, but it just felt right this time to just put them there and stare at them because white roses are my favorite ones. So, so, so cute. Ignore the background noise. I'm making dinner. I'm just making spaghetti and uh, minced meat. Dinner is ready, so that's what I was making, and I'm having it with a glass of red wine. I'm not a fan of red wine, but I buy it when I crave it, and for that, I usually go for the Chippy Chip for cousins or her other cousin, um, Fourth Street. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's the name of the other Chippy Chip. So that's dinner for today. Good morning, guys. I hope you're well. Today is going to be such a busy day for me. I'm actually waiting for a Zoom meeting that's about to start in the next um, 15 minutes. So yeah, I'm having breakfast, I'm having uji, that's what I feel like having for today. Let me get started and then I'll catch you guys later on. Guys, I'm actually watching this BBC documentary on the whole coronavirus pandemic. It's called 54 Days China and the Pandemic. You can check it out on YouTube because I'm watching it from YouTube. And it just gives a detailed sequence of events on how the whole pandemic situation began in Wuhan and how they handled that situation leading up to mid Jan. 2020 and i think it's interesting if you'd like to watch it i think it's such an eye-opener and that's what i'm watching before i go to sleep good morning and i know my earrings have an issue but guess what i'm just gonna wing it like that because I think they're cute. I think they're cute and he imetokana to say asubui anyway. So I want to submit the outfit of the day as well as the scent of the day. Story of my life. I can't figure out which shoes to wear. But I think I'm going to go with these, the maroon ones. That is my dress for the day. It's from my recent thrift at Gikomba and I don't have a black bag but I think that bag will do so yeah i'm wearing a silver ring a silver watch and my situation ship <laughs> silver earrings and yeah that's the outfit of the day let me show you the sense of the day i'm wearing y by if saint laher and i'm also wearing sweet whiskey by bath and body works
I'm so tired and lazy as well. I think I'm going to order out because even tomorrow I have work to do in the office. So I'm going to order something on Glovo and then have that as my dinner. My food is here and I'm about to dig in. Although I feel like I'm craving githeri, which I think I'll make tomorrow as soon as I'm out of work. So yeah, let me dig in and see you guys tomorrow. Good morning. I hope you're well. Today is court day and I'm headed to court. It's currently at uh, 7.30. I want to have breakfast and then just go to the office. The matters are going to be virtual. I have four hearings. So yeah, that is that. Let me submit the outfit of the day. Although I barely share my professional aspect of life, I don't mind submitting this outfit of the day so here we go so i'm wearing this suit that that is from the undisputed woman my blouse is probably thrifted from the streets and those are my shoes these are usually my court shoes they are chunky heels for comfort and yeah that is that that is my outfit consider these an exclusive guys i barely show this side of my life so let me go have breakfast and i'll catch you guys later for breakfast i'm having two sausages an egg and baked beans and because that's literally proteins i'm having that with a glass of pineapple peach juice that i made and the recipe for that is on my channel so if you're interested you can check that out so yeah that is going to be my breakfast let me dig in and head out I'm going to make oven barbecued wings. If you'd like the recipe for sticky wings, you can find that on my channel. So let me begin. I'll show you the steps as we go along. So I have separated them into, I call this the wing and I call this the small drumette. And then these you boil and make chicken broth with if that's your vibe. I'm going to add black pepper and salt. If you want them crispy like me, you can add baking soda. If you don't want them crispy, you can leave out these. So Mimi, naongeza, bicarbonate of soda is the same as baking soda. The next step is to bake them in 120 degrees for 30 minutes. I'm using a nonstick baking paper, which is that, and you can get that from the supermarket. And then after those 30 minutes, you'll add on the temperature to about 200 degrees and then bake for another extra 30 minutes. After 30 minutes, you return them back again into the oven. But now you increase your temperature to about, focus, so that was 120, you increase your temperature to about 250 for that golden brown color. I am making fries as well, so there goes that. Once your chicken is done baking, you're going to use barbecue sauce. So this is the brush I use to baste, but I don't think it will even be necessary, but let's see, let's see, let's see. So once you're done baking, you put them all there and then you add in your barbecue sauce. And guys, you can make your own barbecue sauce using Worcestershire sauce, oil, ketchup, honey, apple cider vinegar, brown sugar, and smoked paprika. You mix all those together and there you have your barbecue sauce. So I'm going to mix them all here and then I'm going to show you how that turns out. You evenly coat your wings with the barbecue sauce and your wings should look like that once you're done basting. Mimi, come on, Emily, I believe only KFC fries taste better with ketchup. The rest, can child, can tomato sauce. That right there is the real deal. That is my dinner. Those are the barbecued wings and those are fries that I have seasoned with black pepper. And that's my juice for today. That is my dinner. And as for dessert, 
and this is my cake that i ordered from black forest it's a white forest cake and that's what is going to be my dessert good morning i just woke up and i'm done making my bed Someone asked me the difference between this Astonish Daily Shower Shine and the other one that I was using to clean in the last vlog that I was cleaning. So the difference between this one and the other one is this one right here helps prevent the buildup of watermarks and lime scales. So I use it daily and then when I'm general cleaning, I use the other one because it's a bit tougher. So this one for daily, the other one for general cleaning. Thank God it's Friday. Today is Friday and it's an easy day for me. There's not much to do, so I'm just going to be staying at home, catching up on my shows and watching movies and all that jazz. So I'm going to go and make breakfast and just carry on with my day. I feel like drinking milk, so I'm going to pick that and that so that I, I can have cereals for breakfast today. So let me have my breakfast. I don't like my cereals too soggy, so I need to eat that up quick. And I'm also having a sausage leftover from yesterday. One thing about me, one thing about me is I believe in playing trap music in the morning. It just sets your energy right. And plus today is a Friday, so it goes without saying. Blooming, blooming, blooming. Guys, I wanted to buy onions. I didn't have onions as well as this small tongue. I want to make giveri. So the thing that prompted me to kwa nyumba was to buy avocado. And here I am back with no avocado. Oh my god, what is my life? I've forgotten to buy one. So, <laughs> oh lord. Oh, how I wish I had an avocado. But it's all good because my cravings will be satisfied either way. Right here, right now. Good morning, guys. I want us to make breakfast. I'm making French toast my way and I'm going to show you guys how I make it. So you need milk, sugar, and bread, and an egg. So you need one egg, like that. A tablespoon, normal tablespoon of sugar, and two tablespoons of milk. Oops, that was like one and a half, so a half, like that. You mix them all together. Mix until all the sugar is dissolved, and then you can pour your mix there. You pick about four pieces of bread. One egg serves four pieces of bread. And then you dip each bread at a go. Don't soak it for too long. Just tap and go. Tap and go. Meanwhile, make sure that your sandwich maker is getting warm. Alright, my sandwich maker is Hot. I place one at a go. You can skip this step and go directly to frying your bread with uh, a little bit of oil. 
I just use the sandwich maker to make sure the egg is well dried and so that I can get these strips. So remember guys, one at a go. Okay, then flip the other side like that. These are the marks that I'm talking about. 45 seconds and then you remove. Remove that and put it in a plate. Do the same for the other two or as many as you are making. Go straight to warming your pan and add in some sunflower oil or vegetable oil or olive oil for today i'm using sunflower oil once it's hot like mine is you place in your bread into the hot oil Cook till golden brown, flip to the other side like that. When both sides are golden brown like that, you use a paper towel and you place them there so that they can drain off excess oil, if any. And then do the same for the other two pieces. And you are done. Here is the French toast that has been done my way. Everyone has a different way, but this is how I make mine. So once you're done and you've dripped off the excess oil, that is my deep fryer. Let me switch that off. You can serve them as they are. Or you can cut into half like I'm about to do mine, like that. And then I'm going to sprinkle um, icing sugar using a sieve. So I'm just placing them like that, like that, like that, like that, like that, all together. And then just half a teaspoon of icing sugar is enough, okay? So that's what I'm going to do. Or you can put desiccated coconut as well, but you can also add uh, honey, but I don't feel like adding honey today or whatever flavored syrup you have. That would be also fantastic. And you're done. One thing about me, one thing about me is that I don't play about my breakfast. It's my most important meal. So there is the French toast with icing sugar, sausages, fresh pineapple and peach juice, ha coffee and baked beans. There is my breakfast. Okay guys, so now that I'm done making my breakfast, I am going to dig in as well as order a birthday gift for my sister because I waited till last minute I should have been named Emily last minute Wawera. but anywho let me do that and carry on with the day I'm so happy today I just reached a thousand subscribers yeah all right guys so that's my dinner that's what I'm going to have today for dinner it's easy guys and the recipe for mashed potatoes is on my channel you can check it out if you are curious to okay so i'm going to dig in now and i think i can end this vlog here and before i go i just wanted to say i reached a thousand subscribers today <laughs> click, 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 click. cheers to that thank you to everyone that has been supportive and Everyone that rides for me, you all know you're my favorite people in that some periods, okay? <laughs> so, to everyone that has supported me, to everyone that has subscribed to my channel, thank you so much. I wish you nothing but happiness, success, and of course, peace that surpasses human understanding, child. So let me eat my dinner and I'll catch you on the next one. Bye!